Hello, I'm Alex and today we're gonna upgrade the iOS on a uh, Cisco device. Uh, it is the same router from the previous video, the 1841. And we're gonna upgrade its image from uh, this one, which currently runs on it, to this one, uh, placed on my TFTP server. So, firstly we're gonna check if we have enough space on the CF card in order to upload the new image. As you can see, the card is 128 megabytes in total and uh, it still has uh, 116 megabytes free. So we have uh, uh, more than enough space to upload this image too. Next, we're gonna uh, copy the image from the TFTP server to our device. For this, we're gonna use the copy command. It is copy uh, source destination. Copy, the source is TFTP, and the destination is flash. Now we're gonna put in the IP address of the TFTP server and the file name of the file we want to copy over to our device, which is this one. And now we're gonna hit enter and wait for it to be uploaded to the device. I'm gonna come back to you shortly. Now our image has been uh, successfully copied. The next step would be to check the MD5 sum. Although this is not mandatory, it is strongly recommended uh, to see if the image uh, arrived properly on the device and uh, has not been corrupted on the way. On a Cisco device, to verify uh, the MD5 sum, we're going to use the following command verify md5 flash and now it comes the uh, name of the image so dear flash and now verify md5 flash and we're take we're gonna take the name of our um, image and put it here. Now this will take some time. In the meantime, on our TFTP server, we're gonna check the same. With md5 sum command, and the name of the image, and now I'm gonna write it to a file named the name of the image that md5 now as you can see our file has been successfully created the way i check this uh, md5 sum is by copying the md5 um, generated on the cisco device and type grep the uh, and the sum created on the Cisco device from our file which we we've created and uh, if this matches it should uh, show it as you can see it matches now we're gonna tell our device from which file from the flash to boot for this, we're going to enter the configuration mode and type boot system flash and the name of the image. Now we're going to restart the device but before I'm gonna access its console 
currently the device is uh, in my lab rack and I'm using a uh, console server to access its console. Now we're gonna issue the reload command in order to reboot the device. And now we can see it uh, booting up over here. And now the device have um, successfully, successfully booted up. And now we're gonna check to see um, from uh, which image it booted up. As you can see, it has been uh, successfully upgraded. If you have any questions about this process and what has been uh, shown in this video, you can uh, let them in the comments below. Have a nice day.